Yo, what up? My name is Don, and today we're going to be checking out Blizzard's brand new trailer for Diablo 4's expansion, Vessel of Hatred, which is slated to come out later this year on October 8th, just four and a half months from now. I am super excited to watch this because I remember going back to the original release date trailer for Diablo 4. I was super stoked to watch that. I burst into tears watching it, so I'm super nervous, I'm super anxious, and I'm super excited to see what they've got jam-packed into this cinematic, which is over three minutes long. So, Without further ado, let's hop right in and check out Diablo 4's Vessel of Hatred official release date trailer. Boy. Young one, are you all right? Nerel? Oh, you're not well. Please, 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 my child, let me help you. Stay away from me! Nerel! Is that how I raised you? No, mother. But... I must carry this burden alone. I must get to Akarat's tomb. But look at you. You're killing yourself. I... I don't Bruh. know how much longer... I can... Shh. I'm here, little magpie. <laughs> Bro, what? I missed you so much. I'm so proud of you. But now, I need you to give up. No, no, no! Of course it's you! <laughs> you must Let go of me! Let go? No. You made a choice. And I warned you, little magpie. Oh my god. There would be consequences. Oh my god. Maybe you're right. Maybe I could use some help. Bro, what the? F <laughs> oh my God, what did I just watch, bro? <laughs> oh my God. Okay. <laughs> Holy cow. Um. Wow. I. My heart is beating so hard right now. Um. Wow, that was crazy. Wow, I feel like I couldn't breathe up until the point where she like came back into her own body. Um, let's just put this off screen for a second. I felt like I couldn't breathe for a second until the until the point where she came back into her own body, and like and like the music can like like came back from a chaotic kind of thing to a quiet, you know, kind of vibe. Wow. Um, I might have a legit heart attack if uh, Blizzard was allowed to make a full movie cinematic. I think everybody wants that. We don't want 
a live action like you guys did before the Warcraft and ruined it so many years ago. The movie was horrendous, but a Diablo Diablo World movie uh, would be the most epic thing I've ever seen in my life. Like, I am gonna absolutely just die. These cinematics that are gonna be that that you're gonna see throughout the game, I'm gonna die. Like the storylines, this story means so much to me and it means so, I, I i i hate saying that it means so much to me because it feels greedy when i say that it means so much to a whole lot of us and like i feel like i'm still trying to control my breathing so hard um okay um wow i don't know what to say i i literally don't know what to say that was the craziest coolest craziest coolest thing i've ever seen in my life <laughs> like and that's coming out in four months. I think that's the way to maintain hype. I don't want any of these year or two, you know two year out announcements. Um, I'm happy that they stayed relatively quiet with it, you know, since the time that I beat Diablo Four to drop this trail. I did not expect to see this this morning, and I spent so much time before I filmed this getting mentally ready because, like, I just was so. I felt like the cat had my tongue watching that whole thing. They are masters of storytelling. I really got to give hats off to the entire cinematic team. You guys are, are legends. You guys are, are literally legends. Uh, I want to like tag them all on Twitter or something like unreal. I, I just don't know what to say. I can't wait to play it. I can't wait to experience this next iteration of the story. It's really cool that at the end screen here, I'm just going to put it on screen for a second. We do see, uh, I think it's the spirit born or spirit. Something uh, is the, next class that we have there i mean it's obvious it's right there on the screen very cool i'm a big cat person i literally have a snow leopard tattooed on my entire uh peck right here on my chest um big cats are my favorite we have i get to put on screen again we have like the spirit cat you know if if, if listen i'm barb life for life right barb life barb life barb life barb life but um it's very cool to see that you know i'm like oh my god and you can get small kitties too i'm like shut up man like I had to buy the little wolf pup when, you know, the game released. I'm definitely going to be uh, buying these, you know, little pets. And, OK, so here's the thing. They're not like it doesn't they're not displaying it like they're companions that you wear on your character's back. They're displaying it as pets, pets in game. Uh, this is a contentious one for me. I don't really want pets that go and pick up loot for you and pick up gold for you in game. I, I just don't want that. So I'll have to look further into that, what they mean by pets, if, if it's the what I think it is. Um, but, um, yes, four months, four and a half months from now, it's coming out October 8th, as long as there's no delays. Uh, I, I wouldn't imagine there's any delays, being that it's only a couple months out. That would be a crazy time to announce delays, to be completely honest. Um, we get a new region. I'm really excited about that. Yes, I will be making a video on all the new things. Uh, wow. I, I can't wait. I'm literally going to pre-order this right as soon as I finish this video. I'm not even kidding. I got to know what people think. I got to know what people think. Um, I, like when I saw the videos at 13,000 views and by the time I was ready to film it was at 45,000 views, that's how long I took to get mentally ready. I'm so excited. I'm so over the moon. I'm just like, like, I, I'm like, like, my hands are like shaking a little bit. Um, anyways, I, I got to know what you guys think down in the comments um it looks like the storyline is going to be epic mephisto looked epic like i gotta go back into it i gotta go back into it there i just i'm like dude i, I th there are so uh, maybe i can go back and watch through it we gotta go back and watch through it and, and just like talk about my thought process right because like i can't i cannot contain myself like it's so good how am i just gonna watch that once and close it down bring it back up play it again baby listen we're gonna listen to a half volume this time and i'm, I'm gonna try to Oh, I got such goosebumps, bro. My goosebumps have been on my body the entire time. So, obviously, the cinematic quality is insane. The fishes, the oil on the water, you know, the, the dead fish, amazing. Um, the detail in her fingernails, dude. Are you all right? The the compassion, the the voice actors. Okay, I gotta stop here. I gotta stop here. Listen, Narelle is a character who really kind of got on my nerves and pissed me off. Oh, I'm not being completely honest. I kind of really was just like, shut up, Narelle, the entire the entire playthrough of Diablo 4. But like, oh my God, her voice actor. I um I gotta find out her name. Uh is it in the credits? Um 
I want to see if it's in the credits here. Uh, I got to know her voice actor. It's it's not even the credits here. It should be. Uh, Diablo, you guys should put the voice actors and everybody affiliated with this stuff in, 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 in the description. Um, whatever. I Dude, big shout out to the voice actor because, wow. Honestly, wow. That's this is all I got to say about that. Incredible. Mirren? Oh, you're not well. Please. Please. Especially Nayrell's voice act. Stay away from me! Nayrell! Is that how I raised you? Dude, the little whoosh sound as she whipped her head back around, it really, really throws you into the moment. But I must carry this burden alone. She started talking to the stone here, and look at my arm. Must get to too. Tell me you guys are feeling the same. Look at you. The detail in the skin, bro. The empathy from her in, in, in her mother's voice. I don't much longer I can... dude I'm here little magpie her, her like her being hesitant I to let her mother touch her and then her giving in to like the I'm demon so proud of that's you. like it's so like but now I obviously giving in to Mephisto right like to give up I thought it was a demon at first, and then and then my brain like clued in that obviously she was carrying the stone, and I I looked at these eyes, and for some reason I started thinking, "Wow, okay." Let me finish off a couple thoughts here. First of all, I know it's the embodiment of her mother on screen right here, but I thought it was for some reason I thought it was. Um, just Lilith's voice was coming into my head, just like her seductive woo, you know, demon thing. Um, Nayrell's scream there is bone chilling. I, I think that's the right word for it. It is, it is just rip saw level, cut through steel, absolutely bone chilling. The the way her voice breaks up, I, I I I would just die to know how many takes they did. The I would love to hear it from the voice actor's perspective. The the emotional place that, or the or the mental uh, preparedness they had to get themselves into the you know the zone they had to put themselves into to give that take. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Absolutely sent, just like complete temporal paralysis up my spine bro <laughs> like oh my god it just made me want to burst out crying like this whole moment kept me from crying because it kept me so in shock that you know by the time it came back to the boat i was like i was like <gasps> like I, I felt like i could breathe again oh my goodness let's just let that play again because this is this is the craziest moment at max volume i just i got it i gotta experience this again warning max volume no, no, no. Of course it's you. <laughs> Dude, the you reflection in her eyes. Let go. Let go. No. Dude. You made a choice. Dude. And I warned you. When, when you get that, that little bit of, uh, oh my god, my skin, bro. When you get that little bit of in inclination of, of the male, the, the lower... Um, you know, the lower vocal cords, Mephisto, like Mephisto's voice comes in, dude, what? And then I wasn't even ready for this arm moment. I could see what was happening with the line down her arm. And I'm like, what is going on? And I could see that there's like bits of her skin going off in other directions. And I'm just like, my brain was not even ready to comprehend what I was going to see here. Bro. The cinematic director, like, I know who he is on Twitter. I follow him. You're sick, bro. You're sick in, in, the, in, the, in the greatest way. You're sick, bro. This is sick. It's disgusting. And, and the animators who worked on this, you crazy 3D visual gurus, man. What in the world, bro? I don't understand. You guys are sick. I love it. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. And then you just get the full presence of Mephisto here. Dude. I control the stone. You hold the stone. Unwavering. Oh, the focus pull from her onto Mephisto. Oh my god. Absolute. Absolute. 
Oh my god. <laughs> top tier cinema. Literally, literal top tier cinema. Literal top tier cinema, bro. Maybe you're right. Maybe I could use some help. I expected something like this based on the 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 just the tone in her voice. Look at her for she's like, I did that? <laughs> For a second, she's just like, what? <laughs> oh my god, dude. They think of everything. Even the thud of that of the paddle into the water is such a dropping such a heavy weight. It's like to signify the weight of her journey ahead. Oh my god. Top tier cinema. Literal literal top tier cinema. This is the greatest thing I've ever seen. This is the greatest thing I've ever seen. October 8th, 2024. Pre-purchase and instantly unlock, instantly unlock in game awards. Yes, I will be. Thank you very much. Like, right now. You gotta be kidding me. Dude. Okay, we're back to just let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I cannot wait. I hope that this rejuvenates Diablo to its former hype. Brings a lot more players back in. Keeps a lot more players back in because Season 4 has been the greatest thing one of my last videos, go back and watch my last Diablo videos. I'll put a couple of them in the, in the description talking about uh, one of them um, that I'm, I'm kind of uh, proud about the outcome of, not that I caused it, but I was talking about a lot of the problems in Diablo 4 being that there wasn't enough player power and they brought all that back. I'm so stoked on the direction of Diablo 4 right now and I'm so stoked that they uh, built off, they leaped off that hype of Season 4 by dropping the trailer for Vessel of Hatred. No better time could they have done that it is the time, baby. Let's go. Drop those comments uh, down below. And as always, please, if you want more co uh, content like this, I will. My focus is re-energized to make a lot of content on Diablo, especially when this expansion drops. Please, as always, like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.